Want to know how profitable stage two in Illuvio can be? Me too. So let's find out together. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So today I want to talk about Illuvio and I'm here to jump with you to stage two to see how profitable it will be. So I already did the experiment with stage one. Now we're going to do the stage two together. My plan didn't change. I still want to get the shards and the gems. So I'm going to prioritize this on my run. I'm going to then later prioritize some of the plants like the fin caps and the gun drops that I want. And then towards the end, we're going to go for everything else we can find it. I'm not planning to capture any Luvio. I maybe try some battles to see if I can increase the experience of the Luvios I have. But we're going to find out that in a minute. Okay, so same plan than before. We're going to look our heat map here. I'm going to look for advantage point where I can actually go and look everything else around. And then we're going to find the best place to mine. So let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to jump here on the top like I did last time. So if you didn't watch my first two videos, go watch it. I explain everything you need to do to get to stage one. And then I also explain everything that you can that you should be doing on stage one to get your profit so you're going to be able to grind your way up to stage one you're going to be able to do everything that you need to do for free on stage zero and and then be ready to start stage one so cool i'm going to be putting teleport here on the top so we can come back easily here later okay so i already spot quite a few fish moves that we want to get it just want to have a look here on the other side now once we up here already okay so i decided i'm gonna get started on the far end all the way up north yeah. well we can check on the map if we missed some lazarus or bismuth here if we pass close to one and forgot to grab it so let's go ahead and check those so there seems to be all geodyne now the next place I want to come is on the opposite side. And I think I see one below me there. Whoa, that wasn't the plan. It seems that there is a reef here as well. We can go ahead and put a teleport there. This is one of the plants that I'm interested in harvest as well. Because it's going to give us the print cap that will help us with the illuvios to level them up. That's why it's very important for you to upgrade your boots so we can reach higher place like this one quite easily or not. Another place here that we can put another teleport, help us out later, get that extra energy. And no sign of the big deposit. So I'm gonna look here and then I'm gonna teleport back here and do this route. Let's try this. I'm gonna leave some stones here for me to pick it up when my energy is running out because there's quite a few reefs on the top here. Okay, so I'm gonna go back here and now let's try to go on the other side and see if we find that big deposit. Okay, I don't think the stone is here. Let's go ahead and try to look on this last part here. Well, finally we find that the big deposit, you can see here how it's a lot bigger than the other ones, quite easy to spot or not quite easy, but a lot easier than the other ones. So let's see what we're gonna get here. So it's to extract some rare gems here. That's pretty cool. Hey, let me kill this. It really doesn't want to go away. All right, so we're finishing extracting this. Now let's get our last few. I'm gonna try one Illuvio fight just to see if I can upgrade my characters or my Illuvios. I just know that one is a stage two. So I may be going for a stage three or further. Close. Okay, so now I'm going to start to make my exit plans. I was hoping to find a reef around here, but I didn't find one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the timer and then I'm going to teleport it here and grab whatever I can here. Teleport to here. I think there was quite a few reefs around this area and that's it. Okay, let's do it. I just want to find if I can see any other reefs when we're going back here. I don't think I have energy. You can see another one. We couldn't use the last one because there is nothing really close here. Let's see if we can see anything. 
close to us that we can fire from here. There is gold. There is a plant. All right, we missed one resource we could have grabbed. It. Let's go ahead and go back to Central Mesa and see what we got it. All right, so we get an epic gem and an epic nature gem. That is really cool. We got a rare as well here. Another rare. That is really cool. I'm not 100% sure how much they're going, but I'm going to tell you on the next video. So if you want to know if this run was possible or not, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.